Have you ever done a render from 3ds Max only to find that when compositing it looks like this? Well that's because if you've rendered to a format which supports transparency, 3ds Max counts the background of your render as transparent. However, luckily you can easily reverse this simply by removing the alpha channel from your rendered footage and I'm going to show you how to do that today using After Effects. So in my uh, assets dialog here, I've got a bunch of different images which I've rendered out as an image list. What I'm going to do is I'm going to remove the alpha channel from each of them and it's pretty simple to do. All I'm going to do is uh, select the first one and right click, go to interpret footage and hit main. This brings up our interpret footage dialog. You're just going to go up to the alpha area and make sure you hit ignore. This will remove the alpha channel from the footage. When you hit OK, that applies it. And now to apply this setting to the rest of our footage, we're just going to right click, go to interpret footage, remember the interpretation, select the rest of our footage, right click on any of them and hit interpret footage apply interpretation and as you can see our background has come back this has been Jados X and this is an extension of Mini Tap Monday episode 5 where I talked about creating image lists from 3ds Max if you want to check that out you can check the link out right there or you can check the link in the description and thank you very much for watching